No, we're not. Yes, I am. No, oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Come on. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm not here for points. I'm here for head tops. Get free care packages. Oh my god. No, 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 Happy New Year, my fully family! Yes, welcome 2022. Your boy is back with the foolishness all year long, baby. It don't change. Not one time, not one moment. I'm me, baby. Hope you guys had fun last night. Hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. Hope you guys were safe. Most importantly, you drank responsibly. You did other stuff responsibly. Okay. I ain't no judge, but you better have done it responsibly. Take care of yourself. Even if you didn't, hey, hey, look. I'm right here, baby. Right here. Right here. Because your boy didn't do nothing. Nothing. Nathan. Your boy was in the crib with it. Okay. Solo. Tolo. For the holos, you know what I'm saying? I then hit up one person. Yo, what's the plan? What's the move? Let's just say nothing at all. I decided this year to do it a little differently because I don't remember in my almost 30 years of my life spending New Year's alone. It's always been around somebody or doing something or I never really spent it alone. I don't like New Year's anyway. I ain't gonna get into that whole long story about it. You know I mean, I just had a bad experience with New Year's and it kinda, I, I've been thrown off from New Year's because of it, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of like a traumatizing moment experience that I went through. I don't celebrate it no more. So, and usually, you know, I kinda begrudgingly kind of get up do stuff so i don't sit around and be with my own thoughts on this day and last night I, I i thought to myself i said let's experience that let's let's try let's see and you know what wasn't that bad you know i actually enjoyed it no i, I didn't have no drinks you know what i'm saying i was sober as a gopher on a roller coaster you know what i'm saying i I relaxed all day. I made my new intro. You know what I'm saying? I hope y'all dig that one. You know what I'm saying? And a new outro. You want to see in the end? Uh, I uploaded my my 2021 review video vlog idea, whatever. Uh, played the greatest Dragon Ball Z mobile game of all time, Dokkan Battle. Uh, <laughs> um. And I caught up on some YouTube videos that I've been like behind on. That that's it. I didn't chill out, man. Chill. I really feel chill. I didn't even play the game. I just honestly chilled out and was just with myself, with me and my thoughts. And it's it actually it was a little therapeutic. I ain't gonna lie. It, it actually it actually felt good. It actually kind of felt nice. You know what I'm saying? So, you know. I say, hey, don't don't feel bad. You wasn't the only one alone. If you was, even if you was, hey, like I said, I'm right here with you. But anyway, kicking off this year, seven out of eleven, almost done. There's a couple episodes left. I'm not sure how many I have. Uh, some clips left. I have to edit and put together in two episodes. But I know it's it's, it's going to be only a couple more parts, and then we'll be done. And I plan on jumping into below zero. Uh, because I've actually only played that one once. I played this one. This is my fourth time. Below Zero I played once. That was months ago. And I would love to go back. So that's probably going to be the next uh, episodic thing on this channel. As we slowly start to get the ball rolling in 2022. Don't know what's going to happen. Um, as I've said before, I got some stuff going on that needs to take care of. Um, so... 
bear with me. Mom said, and I still appreciate those that's been around and still bear with me. You know what I'm saying? And if you do, always remember like, comment, subscribe, come join the family, come join the gang. I didn't reach 100 last year. But you know what? Hey, we can start off this year with some new goals, man. Let's hit that 100 for the end of January. I ain't gonna hold y'all up no more. No more jibber jabber. Let's dive up in this thing. So, the last episode was uh, wild. One of my more wild expeditions that I've been on. Oh, that's nice, 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 great, beautiful. But, um, we have yet more to explore. Before I wanted to go all the way down there, I know there's another um, area I haven't really um, explored 100% just yet. Oh, we made it back 4%, that's crazy. But um, that would be uh, the bulbous area, the blue, like the bulbs that's like air pockets or whatever they are. I don't remember what they call them. But there is um, something to find down in that area. So I want to make my way towards that this episode and actually go down a little bit deeper. Ta -da. Do you not open up if you're I do. Do you not open up if you turn off? No, I hear you open it up, douchebag. I don't think. Oh, what is this? Oh, oh, I'm stupid. There's no batteries in here. <laughs> Not just because it's turned off, W. There's no battery. Oh my god, I'm I'm embarrassed for myself. Better. That it is, gems. That's it is. Now the better question. Where the F was that bulb place? Which way do I go again? Uh, why, um, <laughs> so I know uh, West is where I just came from. Um. Because that is the containment platform. And that cloud off in the distance is the island I just came from. So... Is it in between them? I don't know. You guys will see <laughs> when I eventually figure out where the F I'm going, man. Uh, okay, south is the ship from my base. East is the island. We just gotta go. Bump it. Bump it, man. You know what I'm saying? Bump it. Huh. Dang it. <laughs> I'm lost. Oh wait, I I just remember where it was at. I'll um, it's at the butt end of the Aurora. If I'm if I'm if I'm not mistaken, I'll uh, I'll see you guys there in a second. Okay, where is entrance I'm looking for? I know it's it's rough to navigate in here with this big old cyclops. I know that for sure. But I wanna say 
Down here? Maybe? Am I stuck on something? <laughs> A wall? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna park up here and we're gonna take Biddy out for some mobility. Is there a ghost Leviathan down here? It's like this fading, fleeting memory that I have right now in my brain. Is there a... Or is he not here anymore? I prefer he's not here anymore, honestly. It's quiet, I don't like it. All right, we ate, we drank. Now we shall play and hopefully find the specific place that we're looking for. I think it's under me. I know it's in a cave. This is it. This is it. It's gotta be, right? Right? God, I can't wait till I get the jet upgrade for this thing. Yeah, bringing, bringing the Cyclops down here is, 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 is hell. And I kind of, before I go too deep and explore a little deeper than what we have been, I want to get the jet upgrade. See, honestly, the easiest way following the story isn't too hard in this game because your PDA will let you know when you're close to something that like holds some significance. Warpy, don't mess with me. I won't mess with you. All right, bro. Deal, deal. I just don't remember where exactly it is. Oh, it's right in front of me. All right, cool, great, it's perfect, actually. Yeah, I was gonna say, where are you at? I remember you being down here, because I remember you was chasing me all through this goddamn place. But I'm here, and we're ready, and I'm not scared. Petrified, baby. Couldn't tell if I used the bathroom in my suit or not. We're underwater. And there's thermal vents all over the place so you can't tell if the water got warmer if I peed or not. What's up? Ah, what's up? What's up? What's up? Get out of here. Get out of here. Going about your business. You don't want no smoke? Alright, ready to go. Because he will come mess with me again. I know he will. I should have brought a repulsion cannon or something. Integrating new PDA data. I'm I'm gonna grab everything before I just get inside. Get inside. Ah, this. See this? Is... Leave me alone. This is the containment. And this is where I find my best friend. This is what the aquarium looks like. Well, soon to be best friend. New PDA data. Blueprint? Shield generator, I already have that. They've had to make finding stuff easier because I, this specific playthrough, I've run into more, you already have this in your PDA blueprints than anything. Would you go down the ladder, sir? God. Yes. Oh, I forgot you was down here. You're kind of important. Not kind of. You are important. I I for sure need you. Yeah. 
Yes, sir. E e e e. Wait, is that no, no? Where? Oh, there it is. It's gonna say, my friend. I'm not leaving here without him. I think that's it too. I, I really do. I, I think that's it for this. It might not seem like a lot, but. It is crucial to the story. This device hums slightly and displays an orange lit symbol resembling an N. It may offer a way to interact with compatible technologies. Yes, it does. It's key. We've learned that. All right. Uh. The end of disaster. It was just those two, right? Come on, Trevor. Let's listen to the disaster first. I have had it with you, risking our lives. Oh, stow it, Chief. The kid can't kill this disease without fish to study. I'm just bringing him home. What? Tell her. Tell her I'm right. You're both wrong. Marguerite, I can't find out how they resist the bacteria if you slaughter them all. It ain't always they oblige. <laughs> it could ain't alive. He means you're being reckless. Father, the outcome's no better if we hole up in here and don't go outside. But we have to find a middle way. There is no compromise. Not while she's on my sea base. Your sea base? I'm going outside. Bard, Torgo has disembarked the habitat. Bard, come in. It's dangerous. Damn it, boy. I knew you can hear me. Chief. Chief, get off the radio and put on your helmet. What? Brace! Yeah. Yeah, they got attacked, dude. That ain't no crab squid either. I'm gonna just. <laughs> That ain't what that is. Ah, the sulfur. It's the sulfur deposit. The brine. That's what you need to look for. That's what you need to follow. That's the way down. This is the way we need to go, baby. Skirdoosh. Skirdoosh. And douche. Now this zone, the Lost River, is honestly spookier, spookier than the inactive lava zone, bro. I swear for God, bro. Wait, is that nickel? Is that nickel? It's nickel. Okay, there are little. Just pieces sitting out. Okay, that's good. It's good to know. Good to know. Good to know. Great to know. Perfect to know, actually. Now, what I like about the Lost River is just the design, honestly, and the underwater brine rivers, which is actually a real life, like, legit thing. Now, unfortunately, I have to take off my drill arm real quick. That way I can just pick up pieces of uh, sulfur without getting out and killing myself. It's how acidic and how much salt is in this brine right here. Uh, is that titanium? Please let that be titanium and not nickel. Okay, cool. This how it's going to be upset. Ooh, big bones. I'm just looking for some sulfur, some, some, uh, nickel if you don't mind. Yeah, if y'all have the drill, <laughs> can't do that. I mean, you can punch it. <laughs> it's not going to do that. It's just funny. It's entertaining. Ah, there's a piece. 
Gently grab it. You don't have to punch it. <laughs> uh, if I'm not mistaken, there is a... Oh, hello. There's a lot of scannables down here. And it's just so... Oh, it's just so lore-heavy and rich down here. Is this nickel? <sighs> Take it. Radio? I'm actually a little shocked. I didn't think there was anything left. Here, explore. I just want to shut your mouth. I want to go ahead and uh, get these upgrades for not only the Thyclop, but also for Pronsu. That way I can maneuver a, a whole lot better. I'll just go around so much faster. I don't remember which way I came in at. But the next time you will see me, we will be back, 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 do that. We will be back down here. We will be suited, booted, and ready to go. There's a reason I'm tucked away in this little hole. I was on my way back to the Cyclops, struggling because my thrusters suck and I ran into exactly what I was looking for earlier him oh you are you an adult size cause you sir are huge. Or not the adult, I think you're the juvenile, because if you remember the ones on the outskirts are not even fully grown yet, but you are so much bigger than Tonto. Gonna land over here. Yeah, Linda. Is that for me? Are you attacking me? No, you're attacking the warper. Okay, that's good. That's great. Perfect. Good. 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 Where did you come from? I was looking for you earlier. Where did you come from? Okay. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Shh. All systems online. Thank you, Tonto. But shut the frank up. Okay, that's time for this. Lights off. I know we have radio messages. Let me let me navigate for this craziness first. All right. Okay, he's not on my radar. That's good. Engine powering up. We're silently run. We are slowly but surely going to make our way out of here. Alright. Came out of nowhere. An alien kraken, bigger than a cyclops. Tore a hole clear through the reinforced hull. I barely got my breather in time. I told her. I said others would come. The rupture threw me clear of the habitat. And the monster turned and bore down on me. And just as its tentacles came within reach, made it appear out of nowhere. She had a sea glide in one hand, a jagged piece of scrap metal in the other. She meant to butcher that beast or die trying. The last I saw her, she had the metal lodged in its neck as the monster did its best to shake her, contorting off into the darkness. I'm certain she got her wish, one way or another. Then I thought I saw a light deep below me. I hope maybe Bart had swum clear. <coughs> now I wonder whether I saw anything at all. Sorry! Our oxygen is low. The habitat is gone. I can't see the sky. Something surely has the scent of my blood. Yeah, that's what happened to... I think that's the end of the Paul Torgel and Margaret 
and Ben? Bill? Billy? Bradley? What was his name? <laughs> I think that's the end of their story. Um, that's, where the, that's where their story ends. I, I think. It might be Bart. That was his name. <laughs> might be one more. I'm not sure. But that's pretty much where... Um, Okay. Hello? That's where their story ends, unfortunately. Till, spoiler alert, Margaret's in Below Zero. I've been saying it. So, as I said in a text earlier in this video, while I was editing, I noticed I did not find number seven or um play number eight or even recognize it as a pda that i found so what i'm going to do right now is play those two for you because they kind of are crucial to the plot and what happened to the degasi overall in general now I, I recorded this video early december so i don't necessarily remember what i had going on with my brain at the time i really never know what's going on up there but uh here is number seven and listen we're sick what how you've been coughing right feeling itchy blisters yeah the biometrics would have warned us if we were sick it's something new it's not in the database come on then what's it gonna do turn us inside out dissolve us into jelly it's an alien bacteria it's everywhere every organism on this planet it's altering our genetic code how are the creatures surviving if they're infected? I don't know yet. Want me to cut some of them open for you? Find out what makes them tick? No. Just tell me what you need, son. Materials. Equipment. Just... Can I have some quiet? I need some time to think. And here is number eight. so happy about Mada. Say, kid, I brought you something. Is that a Leviathan outside? Towed it home on the back of the sub. You killed that thing? It's still breathing. I was about to finish the job, but I can stay in chat if you'd like. No? Then make yourself useful and pass me that hardened blade. Are you out of your mind? You brought that thing here? What if it's not as good as it looks? Why have others come? You prefer it got curious and came of its own accord, or it got messed up and dragged here? When we get off this planet, I am going to drag you through every court in the damn Federation. And that explains why their base was attacked by a Leviathan, because I uh, was never stated clearly if it was a baby or you know, a uh, new hatchling or anything like that. Could have just been, uh, that was the Leviathan's significant other. And that Leviathan came and got revenge on all of them. So, uh, again, I apologize for, um, messing up like that. You know, I am a fool <laughs> and this is fully gaming. Uh, thank you. And I'm pretty sure it's known by now. This is life pod two coordinates attached. We're way past our safe depth and bleeding O2. We'll have to swim for the surface, but it's 500 meters straight up. We'll make for the rendezvous and keep you posted. Out. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Really? Huh. Emergency speed. Warning. Vessel counterfeit. Excessive noise. See, there, the I knew time. it was two. Oh, God, would you stop? I ran over somebody. <laughs> that... What... Okay. Alright. Uh, 
<clears throat> Real quick before we go to uh, Lock Pot 2, my brain wouldn't shut up. So while I was thinking about it, I said, bump it. I'm going to go ahead and make my fish tank like I said I was earlier. And I went ahead and made the upgrades to the Cyclops and the prawn suit that I could. Um, so those two are ready to go. I mean, all it was was the jet pack upgrade and the uh, uh, death module for both of them. And then I did the fire suppression system. So those are ready to go. But I'll show you guys real quick the aquarium double decker. You know what I'm saying? I could even get in there thing with, with my boy. It's a cuttlefish. I can't pick him up and take him outside. It's it's he's adorable. I the only thing is I can't like interact with him in here. If I let him go, let, he was he'll stay around the base. He's basically like a dog. You know what I'm saying? But like I'll be able to play with him outside, pet him, give him treats, like just interact with him. Yeah. I don't know. But then I also I remember this egg that we found. I want to say like first episode or second I completely forgot about it so I was looking through my lockers because I also did some farming because my brain was telling me I have to fill these lockers up and I don't because I know I don't because I don't need all those materials but I still did a little anyway for the Cyclops and my base I, so there's some stuff in the lockers now anyway I'm not sure what this one's going to be I, I, I don't understand that texture pattern I don't I said, usually you can tell by looking at um the egg, like what's it about to be, but then you can't. So I don't know. Are we gonna top off? Uh, you haven't missed anything. I just took a another picture of my base. Just whatever. Um, Aquariums yes. provide an ideal opportunity to study alien fauna up close. Select carefully which life forms you bring on board. They may also be studying you. Yeah, I'm sure that little guy is studying me. Wait, this is the funny. I, I was down there. He was down here. Oh, it's fine. It's on that side. Oh, okay. So that's what I said. I was like, I'm sure there's nothing down here. Okay, it's on that side. Never mind. the blood kelp forest i was coming back here anyway guys dang it i could have saved myself a trip because i planned on coming in this way the yeah this way to the uh lost river because trying to navigate through the the bulb area that's going to be a pain in the butt so how did i miss this Okay, sorry. I remember near the entrance there was uh, there, uh, there is uh, yeah one of those uh, ghosties floating around here. Yeah. Integrating new PDA two plus two minutes. Yeah, we are. Uh, I'm all uh, yeah. Hmm. We're gonna play that. We're gonna make our way back to come back. <laughs> Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Flotation devices failed. We're flooding. Evacuate. Wait. I can reconfigure the O2 system to act as a bilge pump. It's working. Okay, good news. We're alive and we've stopped sinking. Bad? The oxygen's going to run out in 30 minutes, and we're 500 meters down. What do we do? We'll have to use the remaining juice to send a distress call and build whatever gear we can. Then we find a way to the surface. Yeah. I don't think that worked out too good for these people. You know, I, I completely just... Playing this again, I completely, like, forgot that part of the story that it's it's made out to seem like 
we were unconscious while all this stuff is happening. And why I say that, and why a lot of people like deducted that is because people were having radiation leak problems um, post crash. So that means they, people were alive, most likely while I was unconscious. There's no telling how long I was, but these people, these light pods I'm finding were alive, trying to figure out a way, you know, just like I am. But yet, well, of course they didn't because apparently, you know, obviously they're dead or whatever, but that kind of adds a little more depth to the story because it's like I was knocked out while I'm not no friends but my co-workers was out here struggling to survive going through all this stuff not Margaret Paul and Bart those are the people we came here to save but for everybody else, you know, unfortunately, they did not make it. And I forgot to, like, even Welcome mention that or bring that up because I wasn't thinking about it. Welcome aboard, Captain. Doink. All right, next time you see me, we will be back in the Blood Kelp Zone. And we will be making our way down to the Lost River. Test it for Subnautica part of them. Thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoy this one. If you do, and if you did, remember like, comment, your favorite moment, subscribe, come join the family, come join the gang. I forgot to give just a little update, um, and a little intro, or whatever. Um, that the sport has been crazy. Uh, since I started this back in October, I mean, it's, I'm, I'm just kind of blown away that, that, like, anybody's even interested in tuning in, like, because it's, it's kind of a tough business to get into, you know what I'm saying, but, um, nah, it's been, it's been great from making pages, social media pages specifically for my YouTube channel, Instagram is the slowest by far, but Facebook has been great. You know, what I'm I think I, my my fully gaming page is, is like approaching 100 likes. Um, but Twitter, <laughs> I know I've said this in a couple videos. Twitter is the place that I uh, it's the easiest for me to reach uh, a gaming community because. Uh, Going into December, I was like close to 300 followers, and then now, today, I'm close to 600 followers. Like, in that one span of a month, like, it was able to just to poof. So, I, like I said, Twitter, man, I might, man, look, man, I might get the bags, and I might come on over, man, if it live perfectly, man. It's, 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 it's such a beautiful thing over there. And even my like subscribers, you know, it's from October to, to November. I mean, they kind of slow and it's kind of eh. Then December again, it was just a little pop um, from like I think I had like 45 subs to now I'm I want to say I'm 73, 74, 75. I can't tell because Twitter <laughs> yeah, yeah, like I people keep messaging me and saying hey man what's up like so I, I, I you know and then of course youtube already always or yeah they always uh, sort out you know they have their little rule or whatever if you don't view time and sub count all that stuff it always updates but again i all of it is just crazy that's why i'm like i can't really put it together because it's really just so crazy for me and I do deeply do appreciate it. And as always, links down below in the description if you want to go check check out my uh, social media pages. That's where I keep most. That's where I do the most updates on what's going on with me and my channel. And I will catch y'all in the next one.